yeah hi friends so welcome to the brian the cat notation uh, uh, in the quantum space so the objective of this session we are just going to start uh, about uh, uh, how the quant uh, uh, how we will be representing the uh, brian the cat notation in the quantum so the definition of the quantum is so uh, uh, in the in the form of quantum the uh, brian the cat notation is a standard notation uh, for describing the quantum state in the theory of quantum mechanics uh, so this is the basically generalized definition of uh, uh, bra notation uh, bra and the cat notation so uh, now we will discuss how we'll represent this bra notation and the cat notation so if i'm just taking an example over here uh, so we have uh, let's take an example so uh, this bra notation will represent uh, represented by we have an angular bracket and then we have any state uh, of uh, so state uh, state of superposition over here it can be energy it can be uh, velocity it can be the uh, weight it, anything anything of an object is so in the quantum state and this bracket uh, this uh, uh, you can say it's a perpend uh, it's an uh, angle angular bracket angular bracket and after the vertical line so this is the bra uh, notation and what exactly the cat notation in it so cat notation will represent we have this vertical bar and then this one and uh, this uh, angular bracket so this notation we uh, will say that's a bra notation this is the cat notation so now let's come into the uh, some uh, some basic facts about the uh, bra notation and the cat notation and then we'll solve the problem so uh, we we uh, in uh, in normal uh, mathematics when we uh, say it's a zero so how we represent the zero uh, same way uh, let's understand how we represent uh, zero in the cat notation so first we'll discuss about the cat notation so cat notation how we represent zero so to represent the zero we we will have this is the cat notation so zero is in the form of the two dimensional we will write an array so this is one and this is zero so this is the uh, we have this uh, uh, in the zeroth position so this one is the uh, zeroth element of an array uh, that is uh, uh, that is one and when we are going to represent one over here so this one is the zero and one so this this uh, first element will be the one and the zeroth element will be the uh, zero here so this is the way how we are representing the uh, basically this uh, uh, when we have to represent zero uh, cat so we'll write like this when we have to represent one cat so in the two dimensional space this is the meaning of the cat so now uh, we'll just come and uh, uh, represent uh, how we will uh, when we have to represent this bra vector uh, uh, this uh, uh, solve the bra vector how we will do that so the problem is so we have uh, assume uh, the question we have here is uh, so we'll just take a question here so we have here 9 plus uh, 7 7 eta this is in the two dimensional space and we have here r4 so what we need to do the uh, what uh, we have to represent this in the cat notation so cat notation means we have to represent uh, in this notation so how we will represent this so as you know uh, we have this 0 uh, and the 1 so when we are representing this one uh, in the cat notation so this will be representing as 9 plus 7 eta uh, we will multiply this with the cat 0 and uh, another one where we have uh, this 4 so what we will do 4 uh, this is the uh, 1 uh, will multiply it by 1 so this is the representation of uh, the cat notation of this uh, uh, two dimensional vector space so now one more thing we just want to be uh, now we come into the bra notation how we will represent the bra notation so when we come into the bra notation so what exactly the relation of this uh, uh, cat and the bra so we have this uh, i am assuming i have this uh, uh, phi uh, uh, this is the uh, cat notation and uh, we uh, when we uh, when we do the conjugate transport of this one so it will become the uh, it will become the uh, phi uh, so and it will become the bra vector so this is the conjugate transport we will write this one so basically uh, uh, this one the, the symbol that i have write it, uh, written over here this is the conjugate transpose uh, sorry conjugate transpose uh, c o n 
जे यू जे ए टी कॉन्जुकेट टी आर ए एन एस Yes, it transpose. So uh, the conjugate transpose. What it means? It is first we will do the conjugate. So conjugate will represent with the help of uh, the star, and transpose will represent with the help of t. So uh, then finally we have this uh, symbol will will become. It is the conjugate transpose. So now what you need to do if you have to convert this into the uh, uh, this into the bra uh, bra vector. So first you need to do the conjugate, and then you need to find the transpose of this one. so we will find the bra of this one so in the next continuation session we will uh, we will solve some problems about uh, uh, some po uh, problem about bra and the cat and then we will come into the uh, what exactly what exactly the physical state of this bra and the uh, cat notation yeah thank you for watching